Okay, welcome. Um, I'm going to just go through a few things that you should uh, you should be doing while playing Final Blade. So it's basically a, uh, a new player's guide, basically. So first of all, uh, you want to be picking this character at the start of the game. Uh, he's by far the best. Pick the, so just uh, just pick this guy. Um, okay, so. Obviously, you want to just complete all these uh, quests, nothing special. Um, we'll end up getting uh, this very quickly, and you'll probably think this. There's only, mm, yeah, there's only like one good character in there. And um, that character is her. So if you get her, then well done. If not, it's not a big deal. When you get to level 20, yeah, what is that sound? Stop making noise, man. Alright, so when you get to level 20, you will get choice, you get these two bowls for free. And um, the units that you're looking for is this unit here. Uh, Uh, where, are, where is she? Jesus Christ. Can't even find her. The healer. You know, I can't find but I know where she is from. So, there she is. Her uh, as well. Those are the three units. Right? If you get any of those three, three especially her. Especially her. Uh, she's pretty good as well. He's good as well. They're all good, but she's like the best out of the three of you. She's basically the best healer. You can also get that same healer in this shop at the moment. For, um, depending on when you're watching this, you will see she may not be here. Um, obviously, the way you get they, these are uh, all the way over there, offering spirits, is just by donating. I need donate. Don't donate. Uh, you could, no. Nah. Unless you're desperate for a healer, then yeah, you would donate like these, you know, with seven stars. Um, is there anything else that needs to be said on this? Um, no. Okay, so. You need to know how to farm Sapphire efficiently. So the way I do it is um, I actually farm this uh, stage. And now obviously you won't be farming this stage. And the reason, even though I've completed more and uh, I don't farm this stage over here is because every day you get for one hour a buff that increases your drop rate. Uh, doubles your drop rate for one hour. So the, basically, the key is to spam as many uh, runs as as possible in that one hour. So, for example, I, yeah, I can clear this perfectly fine, but I can't clear this fast. I can only clear this in about one minute twenty. So because of that, I I from uh, this stage here, which I can clear about. Uh, under 20 seconds so that's basically what you're aiming for you're aiming for a dungeon that have, uh, I don't know if these are dungeon what are these things? I don't know roads hill road whatever they're called and um, basically it's basically 20 seconds 20 seconds max but 20 25 but mainly below 20 below 20 obviously as a new player just farm the story until you get stuck on somewhere and then let's say you you know wherever you get stuck just pedal back until you find a place where you can farm it comfortably within 20 seconds for that one hour buff right for that one hour obviously once once my one hour buff is up then i don't mind farming it so i just leave it on find that it takes a minute because the buff is not on and doesn't matter. Maximum rewards, right? 
the second thing you want to do is join a clan. Join in a clan, then you can do your clan raids. And clan raids gives you rice, and of course, rice allows you to farm, which means more suffer. But more importantly, it actually gives you suffer. Even though you doesn't it's not show me, uh, every uh, I think it's every five or ten levels, um, you get suffer. So make sure you join active guild very important once you're in the guild this will open up allow you to join this your clan leader will choose which side this is all automatic you don't even like it's just you just um go in here and you select the characters what you want now what i do I just press all to deploy i just leave it like that i don't really care um what else go to market while you're farming the adventure, you're going to be getting lots of pearls. What you spend your pearls on will be on these, right? Primarily, yeah, definitely these. And here, you'll be buying these. I wouldn't suggest you just buy them. Only for desperate would you buy these. You buy these, of course. Sometimes you might buy these as well, which is, which is fine. I do that myself. But try and avoid. Find this is kind of a waste, and I'll tell you why in a minute. So, here the daily dungeons you buy tickets, and um, you buy up to like 50. You come in here and you can farm those scrolls, as you see here, there's weapons. Got weapons, you've got the boots, you've got the accessories, and so on. On Sunday, all this is open, and you can select where you want to uh, farm. So, obviously, as a new player, you don't want to buy 50 tickets, is, is cost you, oh, I think, cost about 10,000 sapphire, which is quite a lot for a new player at the beginning because you want to be using that sapphire to be summoning. So, you know, be uh, manage the sapphire well, just buy a few. You know, buy it because it is oh by the way it does go up the more you buy right so it's cheap at the start right so if i buy it 300 now as you see it goes up uh buy this every single day this ticket is very important to buy as a free to play uh this is a very rare you will barely see this and you'll use it on these special banners here and they only take these uh like so you see, I got ninety one. It took a while. It took me a while to get that because I'm. I would say I'm freemium. I wouldn't. Uh, I only buy one thing. Well, I'll explain what that is in a minute. When you summon, um, when you begin to summon, you will do a ten percent. So, just summon quickly. Yeah. So as you see the ten percent now. My rights, I should be carrying on. I kind of feel like I want. I kind of want to carry on, but uh, this is a guide. So I'll stop here. But. Um, reason why you want to save as, as much as sapphire as you can to get that 10 percent and obviously you want to increase um your inventory your hero inventory you can do it from here or you can do it from the hero injury here and the rest you can do it from here as well while um another important thing is um you have to decide whether or not you want to buy this or not like this like they did update this recent now uh, not too recently well in the dungeons the mobs drop the sapphire right and this fairy picks up now you get a free one which is some sort of golem but his um efficiency is only 50 percent feels a bit lower than that 
in my opinion. She'll pick it up and she'll pick up the full amount. It lasts for 30 days. It's pretty cheap, as you can see, very, very cheap. And uh, that's all you really need to buy. You could buy this, but this is a luxury item. But this is kind of like, I would say somewhat, somewhat mandatory. Like, I mean, playing this game without this is pretty tough. Like you would have to, like you'll be severely, like, let's say for example, in a day you made 10,000 stuff uh, through farming with this, but if you had the the golem, the free player would probably be making I don't know five k. So it's you know it's doubled. You know what I mean it's a big deal. It's a big deal. But as you can see, I've got a decent amount of um, sapphire there. That took me two weeks to farm. That's almost like two weeks. And if you look at that, how much that would cost. You know, that, I guess that would be like two hundred pounds. So, well, like one one eighty, I guess. Two week farm. There's no need to like literally. There's no need to buy sapphire in this game. So, yeah, you can you can literally farm it very easily. PVP also gives you sapphire, depending on your rank on Sunday you'll get uh, the rewards so depending where you are at so for example i'm at level 40 rank 40 sorry so i get that amount as the same for each one if you want to buy these i can't buy them can i i cannot i have enough points here yeah, yeah. this will um if you use these boxes So you open them up, you get the coins. These are used for these skills only, to maximize these skills. So, for example, if I wanted to max a ramp, that's what you buy that, so that's why. It's the only place you can get them from, it's from PvP. So that's why you buy only those uh, items. You want to make sure you do all your dailies and your weeklies. Like, don't forget to do this. Because you'll get these um, FB points very rare now because uh, we used to get them through logins and stuff. Well, you mean logins, but they've put that out and replaced it with tickets, which is fine because the tickets are kind of, but yeah, it's fine, I guess. These are the only things I would recommend buying. And I wouldn't even use them straight away, but I would, um, yeah, just buy these. Don't bother with these, these are extremely expensive. And these like selector bottles, like the, this game is extremely generous when it comes to uh, events. So don't worry, like they will, you will eventually be able to get one of these, these selectors. And they like, they in, tend to hand these out as well. So it's not a big deal. You just need patience. Um. When it comes to gear, oh yeah, I forgot to say gear also gives you sapphire as well, as you can see. Uh, because this is um, eight star gear, so the lower it goes in the rank or the tier, the lower it is. So as a like when you pair your gear, will probably be selling for like three to four sapphire. Hence why I did buy this, which is a um, auto um, uh, sells. All my like the heroes and the gear automatically, which is a bit ex not expensive, but it's again, as I remember, I was saying it's a luxury item. You don't have to have that, you can manually sell it, you just go into your inventory. Obviously, you know, there'll be times where you have like 10,000, 20,000 rice, so you're going to be, you know, having to check every certain, you know, maybe every half an hour come clear out your inventory you know so that's why i bought it but it's still it's very manageable very manageable um yeah with the gear though let me go just go ahead they're going to give you free gear 
from what I can see, yeah. So they give you, is it Awakened? So Awakened, which is fine, Awakened. So you get a uh, five star and a six star Awakened. And you select which heroes and get two of each, which is nice. Level 50, or oh, you will take your, not take you too long. Depends on how, it won't take you too long to get to that. It's a shame that they're not giving you tier 7 straight away. But again, yeah, like these kind of boxes, awaken the boxes, they tend to give them away through events as well. So don't, don't worry too much. You get, uh, as a new player, you get this, 10 of these heroes uh, summon tickets. So you have to wait seven days. Also, they give you all these uh, these things here. Evolu Essence Evolutions. So, this is good. This will help you get your uh, first eight star. Now, your first eight star that you get, it's very important that you pick the, the correct one. Um, in, the, in the description, I will put tier list so you decide uh what to, to pick this is your first um yeah just complete this nothing special there's some nice rewards uh for that mm -hmm. again the same yeah nothing special here <sighs> so you've got these tier fives, I'm not awakened, but I wouldn't recommend. Um, you could level them up. I wouldn't recommend uh, awakening them. Right. So when you level up an item, when you get it to max level ten, you'll be able to awaken it. And um highly recommend you do not awaken anything but but these. Now obviously you'll be thinking to yourself, there's no way I'm getting these uh eight star tier five. Yeah, now the game does give these away quite frequently in events and stuff. So did we get them? No, but you will get them like like again patience, like you will regret awakening like just for example look all this all this i got all these awakening seven stars i've got them for free free all of that is free these are all free that the game has given you know so a bit of patience wait for their events you'll get them do you know what i mean do you know what i'm saying right like, all the seven star awakening gears is all free. I've never made one, it's all been free. Um, they're starting to give away eight star awakening stuff, but you know, because they this because um, this event here does have it, but um, you know, depending on when you see this video, this event may not be up. But you see what I'm saying, like, uh, so the so we've covered this daily, so make sure you do that. Training is part of the dailies, right? So, you know, just leveling up your units, right? Going down, make sure if you leave it like that, yeah, make sure you click it to stop the animation, just spam it like that. Quick, so it's quick. Don't bother with this, don't touch it. I don't even know what this is. I don't even understand it. It doesn't do anything. Let's see. Like one, what is this? What's it? Absolute crash, crash. So, um, again, this is also part of the daily. This gives you boxes. Those boxes, did I open them? I did open them. They, I guess I just do one. So that's basically, I mean, so it's very simple. I don't even need to show you that. But um, these are the things you can get in here. Okay. 
Okay. You want to be spamming this. As a new player, you won't be able to do, probably you might be able to do medium. Obviously, basic, medium, I don't know about hard, but these two. Make sure you do these every day. These will give you these orbs. You open up the boxes. And uh, if you're lucky enough, you'll get these. Yeah, these, are, these go from rarity. The best is the red ones. So what do you put on? It's pretty simple. Just put damage, damage, HP, armor. They have released new ones, actually, uh, attack speed. So attack speed sometimes you want to. So when you level them up, make sure you push them to level four. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. For, like, I guess plus four gives you um, two uh, stats. Plus two gives you one stat. Now, you only want a plus four. Plus two is okay, but plus four you want to reserve for like the gold uh, legendary. I don't know what they call that. The legendary, wait, was this the hero? So, and for the two stars, or sorry, the full of fours and below, just make them two. You don't want to wait for. Um, like four of them, like it's a bit of a waste. Maybe for four stars if you're desperate, but you know, for one of your main units, I guess. But don't do that for every unit. It's... Again, patience, you know. Um, went for the summoning. You need your friends. Make sure you get many people active. People active. Doesn't matter their, their power or whatever. Just make sure they're active. And they're giving you these coins which you can spend in the shop. You can buy various items. Um, oh, yeah. Make sure you get a, uh, a mentor. Just pick one. At level. At level 40, you get some rewards, and then at, when you graduate, which is level yeah level 60, you get some more rewards as well. Nothing big, but yeah, it's nice. It's decent. Now we'll see when you become when you graduate, then you can get your own disciples and get some some rewards. Um, done. We've cleared this. Um, oh yeah, because I have um, these, don't I? Yeah, so never summon on this until you let you only summon with these uh tickets from this banner. Never use uh, sapphire, I think it's like 2000. Don't even bother. Uh, this again, one of your daily requirements is to do free summons. So, what I do is just summon on here, and this gives you a free summon as well every day. So, I've got one. And then two here. Um, what else? I'll be putting the tier list below. So, but uh, you'll notice that most people were rocking same kind of teams, right? You can see, you can see these units here, right? If I was to go to him, pretty much, well, at least these, these two are the same, the healer there. But um, the, the team comp, um, the, the formation that you want to be leveling up is um, this one, illusion, gives you bonus damage. This is like your DPS set. Then you want to wind is your defensive set bonus block rate, and then the next one would be ambush, gives you bonus armor. 
Again, another defense. And the last one will be outspread for. Ah, you might want to use this at the beginning, but yeah, I guess I don't really use this personally. But I can see as a new player because you'll be lacking heals, so you might want to use this. So those are the ones. The rest I wouldn't bother with. Um, yeah, because the higher you get, like near the end game, like. The DPS, uh, I was using Illusion for a while, but once you start hitting that end game, or things start, well, not even end game, when things start struggling, basically, you might want to change your formation to a more defensive one, to like bonus, bonus armor and so on and so forth. Um, you want to have recommended, um, you want to have two healers, not all the time, you want to have. Even I don't have a healer now, it's because this is just my farming team. Remember, I'm trying to do it under 20 seconds. So, But uh, if you're struggling, so for example, okay, if you're doing this, so for example, as you see, this formation is wind. And uh, I've got, I'm rocking two healers, you know, two um, warriors and one... Uh, Assassin there in the back. So, what I like about warriors is that they they like tanks, right? They have some of them have pawns, so they will go in the front. Now, this assassin also goes in the front, which is annoying. They, yeah. So you can see. They're just soaking up the damage that my uh without these uh guys my team would die right so without a, so okay so i'm gonna end it there right so let's change them up okay, let's take them out those two uh those two uh two warriors out and let's put in you and you so let's see if they die I do have two healers, but I want to see. Got the iframe. But I have the damage, okay. I'm struggling. She's struggling by this one here. Okay, not bad. Yeah, I'm still quite surprised actually. But it's kind of, I'm um, probably because I'm over geared this. Yeah, but still, I would never like. Um, higher I get, I would change it to the, the more defensive formation, personally. Uh, the stronger you get, the more DPS you can put on, like. I'm sure the people like these dying. I don't know. Unfortunately, I can't see their gear. Oh, these are hackers. Like, it's <laughs> level 23. <laughs> impossible. Absolutely impossible. I can't see what. So I could see, actually. What's he got? So yeah, he's just rocking with um, one healer. He can he can do that because you know he's maxed out, right? So he can get away with just the one healer. Well, I can really most only whales can really get away with just using one healer at the at the top end. So you're gonna want to invest in two healers eventually. Right, eventually you're gonna want to invest in two healers. Um what else? Oh yeah, this I, I I don't even bother with this. Don't even some nice uh, not even nice rewards do. Like they're kinda of terrible. And uh, maybe 
something special happens? I don't know. I don't bother with it. I, I don't miss it. There is this destiny thing as well I don't bother with as well. I don't even touch this. I've done it three times. These are nice rewards, but you need a certain units. I don't have them, and I, I, I'm not going to skip these units just so I can get these rewards. So, yeah. Um, is there any raids up? Oh, oh, there is. So, okay, let me show you a raid quickly. So, what I'm going to do is basically what you should be doing. How you actually um, fight this. So, you'll start off in the middle. And then he's going to do some animation. That warning sign. So you go down here. Don't go up here or here. Go here. The one below. And let's see if they see that. And then once that's dead. Obviously, depending on where you might not be dead. But uh, go down. Go down there. And then go up here. I should be in the middle, but it's alright. Go to here. Place that off. I'm leaving this one for last because he does some sort of skill that just wrecks you. That's some charm. That he charms you up. That just does too much damage. So that's the kind of uh, formation you want to take. Uh, so start from the middle, go one down, one down, and go to the top, and then you finish up. Um, what else? You can also join other people's raids. I'm not going to do that, but uh, you can do that as well. Uh, the raids do give you awakening stuff, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. They give you awakenings, they give you these. You should update this. It's been a while. Like they give you these these uh those frock things and um what was it? What was it? Uh, yeah for this. But they 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 given out these internal frock essences for like like smarties, man. They're giving these out so much. So you just go be a bit patient because eventually you'll just have loads of them. At one point I had like I remember I got max I am pretty low. So I'm 139 but I remember I had like 800 and I, I burned them all doing some upgradings and stuff. But I, it's been such a long time since I've actually bought those all, you know so once things start flowing it's good. Um, I think I might have covered everything. Yeah, if there's any other questions, I get, oh yeah, spins. Yeah, make sure you do all your spins. Obviously, we've updated this as well, so some of it's pretty nice. A thousand stamina is not bad, you know. More stamina, more. Or should I say rice, more rice, more uh, sapphire. Um, or this, <laughs> if you've got any questions about this, this is just absolutely random. Fail, done. Like, I never bother with this. It's just got to randomly catch the corporate. Like, you know, I don't even understand it. Dude, I don't even bother with it. And no one knows. No one knows. Um... What else? That's about what is it? I don't even know what that is. Um, change your name, change your leader if you want picture. Um, after a year, this will light up and you can get your reward. Oh shit! Yeah, but <clears throat> make sure you turn off. Cutscenes, yeah, battle cutscenes. That will ensure that you have a faster run because just turn that on.
Okay, so basically, when they do skills, oh yeah, oh there it is. See that, the um, that skill there, that animation. You don't want that. Nah, waste of time. Actually, no, wait, does it even, um, I don't think it actually matters, actually. Yo, I don't actually think it matters. Because they pause anyway when they do their skills, just remember. I'm pretty sure they pause. So they might scratch that. You can I think you can just leave it on. I have to wait for them to do a skill. Oh, I don't know. Was it faster? I don't know. I think it's the same. I think it's the same. It, I think it's just me. It's the sleeper. It just feels that it looks a bit faster, but I think it's the same. It's up to you if you want to have that on and off, actually. Um, yeah, that's it. That, that is it. I can't think of anything else. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, if there's anything else you want to know, let me know in the comments below, okay? And that's it. I'm going to stop the video here.